the Challenger RT Scat Pack is intended to bridge the gap between the standard RT variants to the more powerful SRT Hellcats. Let's get started. So this is the Scat Pack wide body with the B5 blue paint from Auto World which is very exquisite. This is as good as it gets. Looking at the front, you get the angry boxy looking Challenger with your retro design with so much details like the headlight tempos, the Challenger RT emblem on the grill. The front chin splitter is detailed in yellow, kind of replicates the uh, splitter guards in the actual car, which Dodge encouraged the owners to remove it. It's kind of a, uh, it's becoming infamous. The hood has the scoop in the middle with the air extractor on each side derived from the Hellcat model. It was a struggle to open the hood. As you can see in a 30 degree angle, it barely opens and you need to squint your eyes and take a good hard look for the engine bay. And you can notice the, uh, wait a minute. Is that a supercharger? Yeah, that might be a supercharger. And this is a scat pack. It has a 6.4 naturally aspirated V8. It's supposed to be no supercharger. Whoops. So the reason behind that supercharge anomaly and this casting is because this is a retooling from the existing Hellcat Red Eye. And the Red Eye has a supercharger. So I believe the to cut cost they retain the supercharger detail in the engine yeah i can i can definitely understand that it would have been cool if it doesn't have any supercharger closing the hood and it will remain that way for eternity i don't want to risk damaging the paint so it has this cool looking red eye wheels with rubber tires and threads looks amazing i like the uh fender flares giving it more character there's the molded windshield wipers, the gas cap, the black plastic interior, looks very nice. And of course the Super B logo and defenders. Now moving on to the rear, you get tons of details like the taillights, the Dodge logo in the middle. I like the uh, separate piece decklid spoiler, it's also detailed black. The black out rear valence. Man, I like the spoiler a lot. Down below is the dual split exhaust, which sounds amazing. Take a listen. Underneath is a metal base with decent details, and it is a raw metal. It's not coated or painted. So excellent quality overall. There's no issues aside from the barely opening hood paint is exceptional so there you have it the challenger rt scat pack from auto world a must have for challenger fans please check out my other videos and that's the end of it